YouTube, what's up guys? This is a video that I've been wanting to make for a long time. I'm gonna be in a movie. I'm gonna tell you guys all about it. Right, right. Saber's with me. Am I supposed to be here? You're supposed to, yeah, you roll your, we're getting pizza right now. We're gonna go pick up Brett, but when I get to the first skate spot, I'm gonna tell you guys all about this. I'm so excited. I have always dreamt of acting and getting my hands dirty and I don't know what I'm saying. I've always had a dream of acting. This is a, just mind blowing this is actually happening. And uh, pizza first. Let's go do this. So the heavy door? I should not be eating pizza. I'm just getting one. Um, you guys have like chips or? We got pizza. Mm-hmm. This is a. Uh... Ow! <laughs> Are you okay? <laughs> Jeez. You have eyeballs. I do. You got pineapple on pizza. I got Hawaiian. Yeah, it's yeah. the best. Which is it, absolutely fine. It tastes good. Brian's an idiot. He's gonna give you crap because he cares what other people enjoy. Yeah, and so will the YouTube comments. Yeah. YouTube comments are really gonna care. Uh, yeah. Well, I have to say, wah, wah. Brian, I got pineapple on pizza. You're an idiot. You're an idiot. Why would no, you care? You're an idiot. You care what other people enjoy? No. Just Pineapple on pizza is just really not tasty. So this is my cheat day, but I messed up last night and had a burger and fries. So I had two cheat days. I feel terrible, but I'm eating pizza. I forgot to put I forgot to put red pepper and parmesan on that. Yeah, I, you, you blew it. I screwed up so much. Good. Yeah, I know, get, get away. Get away. We are off for the day. Andy, I wish you filmed what just happened. Wow. Every almost all the pineapples fell off. My this is so good. Yeah. You gotta fold it over, bro. This is so good. Hey, I'll get a piece. Hi, Brett. Get in the car, we're gonna get a coffee. Okay, okay bye, bye Oh, yes, okay. The Conservatory of Coffee, Culver City, California. The best coffee ever. Yes. Super good. All right, first spot of the day. How are you doing today? All right, well, we're at the school, and I fall right away. I hit the biggest chunk of plastic or something, and I smashed my camera on the ground. Hopefully this so clip. Bad. You saw it, right? Yeah. I, that's how I started. I hit the, my, the same hit bruise. That's how I started yesterday, too. This trip is not going that great for me as far as, like, not as far as bodily harm. I ate it. Again. Really? Yes. That's the second time I've fallen in two days when I actually wasn't even trying a trick. Okay. I'm gonna be in a movie, guys. Oh my gosh. I, it's funny enough that the day before I got an offer for this movie, I was talking to William Spencer about getting more into acting, and he was like, dude, I'm gonna help you out. He's like the best human ever, and he was gonna help me out, and then the next day I got an offer, so completely unrelated to everything I was talking about with William. I've known about this for a little while. I've been waiting to announce it here on my channel because I had to wait for Variety to do an article on me. Look at it right there. I'll link this in the info, but it tells you all about it. The movie is called Paved New World. Alexander Garcia is directing it. He's also working on the movie Skate. I just dropped my phone. He's also working on the movie Skate God. Some of the other confirmed cast is Chad Tepper, Daniel Pinder, and Camilla Alnes, who was on American Horror Story, uh, but they've all been in a variety of things, and this is a dream come true. I w I've s always wanted to get into acting. This is a 90s era skateboarding film, so I my character's name is Gibby, and uh, it seems like it's going to be a lot of fun. Um, I cannot wait until it drops so you guys can check it out, but uh, I film in August. I'm going to come back out here to LA to do it at uh, some point in August, I'm not sure when, but... Oh my gosh. I'm just doing it like a vlog or so today, so you guys get to hang out with me, but I can't wait to actually go and do this project just to get my hands dirty with it and uh, experience it all. I think it's gonna be a lot of fun. It's a comedy in the 90s. The 90s were a great time. Brad Kavoy is a producer on this film, and he has done some epic films. Biodome, Beverly Hills Ninja, Dumb and Dumber. Yeah, he's worked on some of his epic comedies. I'm just really, really hyped to uh, be involved with this. I'm honored, and uh, I'm gonna keep you guys uh, along for the journey, so don't worry. But today you're gonna get some skateboarding, and I'm really really sore from yesterday, but I'm gonna go try to get warmed up and skate this pink table. I just wanted to tell you guys about it and uh, just announce that I'm on this project and I'm super excited about it. I'll fill you in more as it goes. But if you wanna check the article of me from variety.com, um, it's linked right in the info. Before I get done talking about this, I just wanna thank Ann, uh, who's one of the producers, and Alexander. Um, both have been super cool and uh, just seems like a really good bunch of people. But let's actually go do some real skateboarding and hopefully not fall. I'm good at that. I gotta say to my man, uh, thanks for hanging out with me in this shot, dude. That was that was fun. And as soon as I got done talking, uh, Vessel was like, I'm gonna jump over this. All right. Oh my gosh! That's insane. You just tried this. Try it one more time. This, that is massive. It's so tall, dude. That's too good for YouTube. You wanna do that line? Let's get a let's get a camera dude on you. 
Oh, and one thing I forgot to say about the movie is that the writing team is epic on this too. It's Scott Mercano and Kip Koenig who did Biodome, which I grew up with Biodome, so it has a soft spot for me. But uh, this painting table looks super epic over there. Let's get, let's get over there. This thing looks so fun. Oh! He did it. He did it. Huh. Oh yeah. video we haven't even said what's up yet. Yeah, he didn't. For, uh, you look good in yellow, Chris Chan. He looks Wait, good in yellow. He does look good in yellow. We like, we're like, like compliment. On a scale? Andy? Yeah, it just goes. On a scale of what? Uh, I feel like I didn't know what I was saying, so I'm just gonna not try to pretend I did. Man, is anybody else distracted by your hand when you do something you use it? It's, 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 instead of my face, it's my hand. Should, and I shouldn't look at it, right? I'm still going. Shh. I'm just gonna look at you. Later, man. It's, oh, that's probably why. It's literally too close to the pole. When you pole dance, and you can't have stuff too close to the pole. <laughs> Welcome, everyone. Sorry. Did anyone see how close it was to my head? Sorry, everyone. I'm pretty sure it hit my hair. <laughs> Was right there. Ah! Oh. Ah, got it. Woo! Step one. Really? Step awesome. Fly, get away. My gosh. Uh, hey, William, thank you for doing your magical stuff that you do. You're welcome. He, every time I skate with this guy, he has something crazy like that to do. It's so hard to talk to YouTube right now because the sun is blaring. But that is it, guys. If you guys want to know about my character that I am in the movie, uh, I, like I said, the article is right down there. I want to thank everybody on the team that uh, I've talked to and been super, super nice. I cannot wait for this to go down. Hang tight for more information. I do videos here all the time. So hit the subscribe button right below the video to see more for me and I'll be back tomorrow with another video and I am so exhausted and tired I kind of sucked today I tried that 50 50 cake flip for a second and failed it's a spongy painting table and you're not here to watch me make excuses so I'm gonna go you guys have a great day if you were on the top of an 80 story building what would you do I'd just lay there No, Andy, you don't party. I am the one that parties. Andy, I've told you, we had an agreement about this, that when we do interviews, you say that I party. No. I've literally paid you to say that. Oh my gosh. Every time you make me repay you.